Previously on the Corbinator. Oh, ooh, ow, shoot. Ooh. Shield your eyes. Look away. I can't look away because I gotta see if it's opening the door or not. Ah! Okay, I think it's ready. Boink. And through. Get set up in here. What the heck are you? What the heck are you? Ow, stop it. So we can get up into the living quarters. Okay. Just gotta swim back and figure out the how compared to the why. Or the giving up, I guess. Oh, dang it. I knew it was getting close. Maybe this side would be easier to get up because it looks like I can actually pull some of the stuff aside with the propulsion cannon. Finally made it to the living quarters. Although these don't look in great condition. However, I will take all the filtered water I can get. Nutrient blocks are good. Some stuff we can drop because we have a lot of things and oh well. We will make the decisions as they come along. A lot of things to scan in here. The bar table. Is that a vending machine? And can I, better question: If that is a vending machine, can I scan this vending machine? Yes. There, we can get a vending machine. This is beautiful. Of course, I don't think we really have any rooms we can build in it, it in yet. But it's fine. Lab counter. Huh. Looks like this was a uh, good decision to try and find another way into the living quarters because there'd be lots of things to scan. Right, can we get into this door? Do we have to cut it open or something? Nah. Okay. Narrow bed. Huh, sweet. Beds are good. It's always nice to have somewhere to sleep at night. Of course, inside the Aurora, I would not sleep at all, but you know. This episode's probably gonna last until I find everything I can in here and then leave, so it might run a bit long because of that, because I don't even know just how much they expanded this thing. So, prepare for the wild ride on the wild side. Aid kit. Open. So this is a 3x3. Three three. Store a bunch of batteries in here. How much inventory space does it take up? It takes up as much as it, you put into it, so that doesn't seem to be very purposeful. Let's go ahead and put it all back then. I mean, maybe it'll come in useful at a later point, somehow. I don't know. If so, we know that it's up in the door. Ow! So I guess it was rather spartan in here. You catch my drift. A lot of people in one room. So here's the door with the code. Now the question is, is which door does this open? Maybe that'll open this door. Dang it. Okay, well, let's try sweet offer. 1869. Dang it. Alright, so we don't have that code yet. Um... Oh, but we do have this one. Baseball cap. Aw, oh, it's a little plushy. 
wall shelves. Oh, for storing things like the little plushie in the baseball hat, maybe. This is so cool. Okay. Um, is there anything else in here? Bed one. It's a bed. It's bigger than the other. It's a bed. And it looks really uncomfortable, actually. Oh, I mean, I guess it looks okay. We've got so many things in here now. Um, so I didn't get another code for that door, which sucks. Um, uh, I don't want to drop any of the batteries or power cells. I'll drop some of these filtered waters. Arcade Gorg toy. Gorge toy, maybe that. Cap. Can I wear the cap? Mm. Probably not. Um. So I think that might be all there is to find in here. Oh, single wall shelf. I guess not. The thing I'm wondering though is where that other code is. Like, maybe it's on one of the life pods, and I have to explore the ocean more to find it? Who knows? Maybe we'll never know. Which would kind of suck, actually. Um, well, I think that might just about be everything we can find, so... Looks like we're going to start making our way out of the ship now. Yeah. Ow. Huh? Freedom! We have gotten out of the Aurora. Woohoo. Alright, so that is the end of this episode. If you like what you saw, leave a like down below. Comment if you have any suggestions for playing this, playing any other games, or whatnot. And it, that's all I got for you. See you later, everyone. Corbinator out. Bench. Benches are good.